There's a little, um, looks like a church. Yep, I mean, you can tell because of the, you know, crosses on top. They have some really neat architecture there. So this is, this is where we took off from at the beginning of the flight some three hours ago? At least, Chad. What time did we actually take off? <laughs> Who's getting murdered here? Is that a crocodile person? <laughs> is that? Look at the statue is like whatever is getting killed is shooting water out of its mouth. And then look at this like ball and chain mace. This is a very Russian statue here. It's a dragon. Is it? There's the Mammoth Museum. This must be also underground. Look at that. That's beautiful. There's outside the Mammoth Museum. A lot of cool, uh, is that ice sculpture? Dude. Yakutsk is pretty cool. Look at that snow tunnel. And this, like, ice cavern. With all these, like, skins and stuff. Pretty cool place. Yo, we looking at Yakutsk stuff? We are, yeah. We're just seeing where we took off from. This must be the facility. I think this is the museum where you go underground into that hill. They got a throne, dude! Santa's here! Look at the tree! This is Santa's throne! Dude, Pog. Found where Santa lives. Anyway, GG chat. Well done! We did it! It may not have been necessarily on our terms, but that was a good flight. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed flying with you. I enjoyed... <laughs> I enjoyed having to, uh, time out like a dozen people who all were getting angry. Yo, you salty, bro? Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. am. You gonna do something about it? <laughs> what are you gonna do? <laughs> are you salty that I'm salty, bro? Huh? Does that, does me being salty make you feel some salt? Huh? Hey, on, does you being salty about me being salty make me feel a little bit more salty, bro? This guy is livid. This guy is furious. You can tell it really wasn't even that bad. Um, because we didn't even have to go emote only mode. But yeah, we gotta harden up the new people, you know? A little bit of mental preparation for what's to come if they ever come back. If they ever dare set foot in here again. I'm just kidding. You guys can come back anytime. Specifically not tomorrow or later today. Okay? Because I ain't streaming today. So, no Monday stream, uh, maybe Tuesday, maybe not, depends on how we feel. What will we play next? We might take, um, a little, we did five days of Microsoft Flight Sim in a row, so I definitely do want to play again, because I think it's so much fun. Why don't we get a couple other games in, and then come back to this? If they're doing a patch this week, it might be fun to come back into it when they've got that patch, and then do some more Airbus 320 Neo flights, and the other stuff. Enjoy the time off, fam. Thanks, Nomad. Hope you had a, uh, a good time in Flight Sim today. And Fall Guys, apparently. But I think this game's too much fun for me to say I'm not playing it again. Because I just want to. That's It's gonna be hard to play the other games, actually. So if you're here exclusively for Flight Sim, may I offer some of our other tasty snacks? 
Uh, we'll probably play Seven Days to Die next. We got a campaign going there that I haven't played in like two weeks. Uh, we'll probably get back into Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. We only did that once, and I really want to play that again. So, getting some classic RCT2 action. And uh, pop into Satisfactory and say hi. So, we might do like. Maybe we'll do Seven Days to Die and Roller Coaster Tycoon, and then pop in and say hi again to Microsoft Flight Sim. And then we'll do one of the other ones. Okay? But yeah, we'll definitely do some more Microsoft Flight Sim. I had a great time tonight, chat. We got to fly through a storm. Uh, with like 30, 40, 50 people from chat. I don't know how many of you guys were there. We got to do a couple of really, really fun flights. We did, um, obviously the Dreamliner was brand new. Two new planes today. And we also flew the Textron Aviation Cessna Citation Longitude. Which, uh, was a trip from... Chicago O'Hare to New York at Kennedy. We did our we did a night flight there and we did a sunset flight um, Just now so like next time we fly I'd like to get even more kind of new Situations I might get brave pick a plane and then start turning on some potential failure states I'm a little still scared to do that, but it would be fun to fly through um, maybe snow ice some inclement weather, something like that, might be might be nifty, and just pick some more cool, do some more bush flights as well. We didn't really get to do any prop planes, so I want to do some more bush flights and some more of the the challenges and stuff. But super fun, good twelve hour stream. The sun's coming up in Vegas right now. Hope you guys are having as much fun uh, with this and these streams as I am. And thank you all the new viewers. If you are still here, that means you have passed and you are allowed to come back on the next stream, okay? If you stuck it out. If you're not still here, then... then don't ever come back, okay? Because if you're not here, you won't hear me say that. So it doesn't mean anything to anyone. We were gonna go to Greenland. We were actually gonna go to uh, Greenland today, and we ended up changing our mind. It, the original flight was gonna be Greenland to um, Newfoundland, actually. And then we ended up completely changing that and going Chicago to Kennedy, which I think was a fun flight. And honestly, the both the planes we flew today were super fun. We, we'll go try some new prop planes and maybe go back to something familiar. It'd be fun to... Get good enough with a plane that I can remember the checklist by by memory. Syntax, please. Thanks for hanging out tonight, chat. Thanks for putting up with a couple of really extended uh, character select screens on the try, trying to find a path for that last flight took way too long. But in the end, I'm happy we did it. I'm happy we flew the new plane and... Uh, Super satisfying all the way around. We got some good memes in today, too. Some good meme vids. So thank you, Liuta, and Elizabeth, for making the cool meme videos. Very funny. But good night for now. 6 a.m. I'll see you guys again Tuesday or Wednesday. And I'll hit you back at that point in time. She's the worst says hi. Hi, she's the worst. And everybody else that's just waking up. P.S. Thank you for end of stream subs. Jazzy, good times. Gifted a sub or to him to himself. <laughs> Thank you for the six months of Prime. Jazzy, good times. And good morning to you. And then retired. Gifting five subs to the community. To Teddy Play, Alcoholic Gorilla, Eddie the Penguin, Glasses, and Visty. Thanks to all of you for being here. And thank you for those beautiful gift subs. I hope you enjoyed uh, the touchdown. Got a, got a nice mixture of stuff. A good North American flight. Um, we got Russia to Japan, which was interesting and uncommon. And then we got, obviously, playing multiplayer through the heart of Tropical Storm Laura. And some good uh, flight challenges. I think I'm getting pretty good at this. Like, just in terms of landing, steering, uh, I feel pretty confident. 
that I understand the systems. I think at this point, I would say that I am competent and that I need practice in order to um, basically get over the fear of that initial bounce and figure out good angles of attack. So wheels touch down and then we just land. So we've gotten landing safely down. Now we need to get landing like smoothly. And that'll come in time if we keep playing. But have a good night, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you have a good morning. I am, uh, some of you have a good night. The Syntax Squids of the world have a good night in Australia. What time? Yeah, very much night in Australia right now. What a good game. I'm going to, like, struggle. I'm <laughs> I might have to play it offline when I wake up. I just might chat. Am I allowed to have uh, plain adventures without you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no Omega Ball. All right, fine. Maybe maybe I'll just log in long enough to um All right, here's my pr I will I promise I won't do any new plans. I might go back to an old one and just, like, fly around the icon or something. <laughs> just do a little icon test flight. How dare you even suggest that? Whew. Well, thank you all for um, being part of these streams, both physically in the game and also being patient when I can't <laughs> figure out how to open a map on the 78710 Dreamliner. I hope that they come up with a way to smoothen out the cockpit FPS. Or maybe I can turn a certain graphic setting down that'll do the same, accomplish the same thing. So maybe I'll just experiment with graphic settings. I might just get Dreamliner spawn into Tokyo at night and just see what frame rate I can get and then play with all the settings. Maybe I'll try that and see if I can track one down that is surprisingly demanding. That might be a good idea. Talks is the camera inverted? Uh, the joystick, you mean? When I angle down... Oh, the camera's not inverted. No, it's just sideways. The camera's like... If you look at where this camera is, it's just like up and to the left. I got it as far over the joystick as I could. I was trying to get both of these in the same shot. So if I did it more level, you wouldn't really be able to see the exact button I'm pushing. Like, from this camera, you can see everything that I do, whether I move to the side to flip flaps, or whether I push a thumb button, or whether I change. If you, Even if you can't see it, you can see that I'm doing something here to move fuel mix and throttle up, down. You can see the whole range of movement on the joystick. So, it's just to show you, like, kind of, kind of an on-screen controller of... When the plane moves, I'm doing this. You can see exactly how much I'm having to control. Does that make sense? So, like, if the plane nose dives and I haven't moved, then you know it wasn't me. So it's kind of like a... It's easier for the viewer to kind of get a gauge on when I'm exerting control or not. Yeah, I've played Elite Dangerous with mouse and keyboard in the past... I'm thinking about trying it out again. Don't worry, Dark. We're signing off now. Don't worry about it. We're signing off now. Just saying our goodbyes and goodnights. Midas has already eaten, so don't worry about him. He's uh, he's doing good and having a good time. But good morning, good night, crew. And uh, we'll see you again in a couple of days. Sound good? Try to get a nice, clean eight, nine hours of rest and see how we feel. We'll try to get the stream started a little earlier so we're not finishing at 6 a.m. as well. But this has been just a intense series of days. I just really, really, really addicted to uh, Microsoft Flight Sim, dude. I did not expect to be smitten, but here we are. So here's to more. Thanks, all new viewers. Maybe we'll see you again. Regardless. Thank you for flying Etal Air.
myself and my co-pilot Midas the dog thank you profusely for your support and um, making these streams a lot more fun because it's just fun to travel with people it's been fun to virtually kind of get out of the house get out of the state get out of the city and go see a bunch of the world sometimes from 41,000 feet above uh, sometimes flying bush planes through France um, going through perilous mountainous passes and trying to land on grass fields everything in between great game great experience and you guys make it a little bit better just a little just notice that people company has little kicking feet it's true Ooh. I don't know if I'll be able to take two days off in a row <laughs> I'm having too much fun we'll see We'll take at least one day off. I need to get some groceries. I have a coffee maker, and I need to get this coffee, dude. I, I got all these coffees. I want to try them out. I don't... I got to go to the grocery store and get some creamer. Chocolate flavor, preferably. I'm going to ruin all these delicious coffee beans with some chocolate. That's okay, because I love chocolate. Literally addicted, laughing my ass off. True. But thanks for the love, everybody. Syntax, if I time you out, do you know you lose your VIP status? Syntax Squid is a, a villain. 39 timeouts in this stream. Nom Nom only has one, but we can make it two. Subdog also only has one. Wow. You see how you are influencing negatively other generally good chatters to misbehave? They followed your example. You're like the the ringleader of the criminal syndicate here. Syntax has ruined me. If you are flying today, have a good flight, everybody. Enjoy what you see of the world. Uh, next time we play, we'll try and start earlier. I really want to do a Vegas to, like, LAX flight, so maybe we'll try that. We did fly around Vegas, but it would be fun to do, like, uh, like a little... It's like an hour flight, you know? Something like that would be cool. Maybe go up the west coast. Maybe go a little bit down in the south. Maybe go southeast. We got tons of the United States we can still check out. And then, the, they, then, then throw in the rest of the world. Do a Mexico flight. Uh, we could do a Canada flight. We could do a cross country from like Toronto to, you know, one of the Carolinas or something like that. So many options. Hawaii would be fun. Good stuff. Can you do bush challenges online with a friend? I have no idea, but you can set up your own flight path and just share it with your friend and do that. But I don't think, I don't know if, I haven't done a bush challenge yet. Thank you for flying with Etal Air. <laughs> Indeed. Your captain uh, salutes you. He's not going to retire to his chambers. Good night for now. TJ, no. <laughs> it's been 12 hours. But it's been a lot of fun. And now I pull the plug and bid you adieu. Thank you, Subdog, for the end of the stream, Sub. You played for 12 hours? Yes, I have a problem. Thanks for streaming. My pleasure, Cole. Hope you guys had fun. Also, thanks for putting up with uh, sometimes 15 FPS <laughs> airports. But the passenger planes are just so much fun. They really are. Until next time. Good night. Good morning. Wherever you are. And most importantly. Please remember. Safety, professionalism, hospitality, those are the principles Ital Air stands by. Whether it's a three-hour flight between New York and Chicago, or a three-day flight between Johannesburg and Cape Town, when you're flying with us you will always feel welcome and cared for. Using our monthly subscription service you will be able to fly whenever and however you want. The best part is, you can cancel at any time, 
just call our customer service with only a small $10 fee, send us an email, tweet us and notify us on Facebook and Reddit. Three tiers of subscriptions are available, and with tier 3 you can always be sure that you will not be used as an emergency slide for other passengers. All the passengers can leave at any time mid-flight. Just tell your flight attendant to open the window and <laughs> all tiers get a free meal, which is a great <laughs> every, gets me every time. Paper towel is not included. We hope to see you on board. And remember, Vital <laughs> Air is not responsible for any injuries, deaths, memory loss, hair loss, diarrhea, or internal illnesses acquired during flight. And remember, Vital Air, beware you're in for a scare. And also for brake checks. That too.